by now, I was teaching at another university in Baltimore, American Institute College of Art, and um, uh, I was starting to feel the need for direct education. So I, I was able to uh, apply to their master's program. Uh, they reject me the first year. The second year, I applied again, um, and, and was accepted. So it's one of the very few students that they have accepted without an undergrad degree. So um, it, which was a, a big challenge to jump to a master uh, without having gone through the undergrad uh, process. Um, so this was my thesis dissertation at that university. I try to do this project, this uh, uh, digital photography project of images uh, that I construct. expression of their face when they come to me and realize they were Dominican. There was just a profound effect into how they will assimilate and kind of relate to the project. I uh, was able to convince the Hudson River Museum to hand the work we did with the third graders at the museum. Uh, first time they have ever exhibited kids' work and uh, the, wow. the work is up there right now. So we're 
trying to create this environment of collaboration uh, between Dominican artists. These are some of the artists working in my studio. We're creating all kinds of different trends. We're having signing parties where we can, uh, the artists can sign the work and the, the audience can participate in that process. Uh, this is a new project that we're doing now. It's 12 artists. Uh, this group is going to do a portfolio called Manife Manifestaciones uh, of Dominican Mañas in New York. <laughs> and we're calling this project the Dominican York Freemason Graphic. And uh, so we have uh, 12 people, Liliana Garcia, Teletade, uh, Rene, Arcelo Santos, uh, Reinaldo Pantaleon, Peter Ureña, Carlos Almonte, uh, Alex Guerrero, un grupo. Eh, y esa es la primera colaboración de artistas que estamos haciendo, tratando, eh, y parte de parte de, de la misión de este proyecto es presentar exhibiciones, talleres y charlas en cuanto a, a, al trabajo de colaboración, uh, tratando de involucrar now uh, kids from the grade levels to younger or older kids, teenagers that are on their way out and figuring out what to do and develop a, a graphic conscience that is so important for them to have a say graphically. And uh, hopefully we'll eventually we're looking for a studio in Washington Heights where we can have a little more of a centrally located uh, collaborative studio, uh, but right now that's, we're in the process of that. These are some of the, the sessions that we have where everybody that have different skills present their, their abilities and are helping each other to produce these prints that we're gonna finish next month. Um, uh, to finalize, I'm gonna, these are a couple of prints that I have done, uh, and this series was called Puertas y Ventanas, and these were all, uh, Puertas y ventanas, windows and doors that I remember from my grandma's house in Rio Verde, in, in El Cibao, and obviously the house is gone now, uh, that I, I did a couple of years ago. So the whole point of this is that um, uh, my experience as a, uh, as a, having my private practice was the, the educational component and the collaborative process uh, is the key, I believe, of, of developing uh, are very, very interested, and I'm glad to be here, and I hope that this can become somewhat of a, of a collaboration between us and you guys, uh, because you are a great audience. The artist needs you guys. We need your institution uh, to have a, a, a way to express this kind of concept, and uh, hopefully, like we were talking earlier in that panel, that bridge that gap between certain established artists and up-and-coming uh, kids that might have an art, uh, art talent, but might not know exactly how to channel it in our own environment. We want to create this project. All this happened outside the Dominican community. And I have been with different groups, but we want to create work that the outside wants to have. I want people to want to do what we're doing, not us wanting to do what we're doing. So that's why we're trying to concentrate the energy towards the uh, symbolic papers of the Washington Heights, and hopefully real estate will allow us to do that, but uh, we're in that process of, of developing that kind of uh, uh, collaborative sense. That, but uh, thank you for inviting me. Uh, these were just a very few samples of the work 